But he needs to chill here and wait for the safety team to help. From where he's sitting, I don't think he can see that that tire is right above his head. He can't look up. If our safety team puts him on the scene, he wants it so hot. As soon as you stop moving, it is so hot in those cars when there's no air. Kyle is desperate to get out. To get some clean air, fresh air, fresh air, anything. He is trapped in there. They're going to need to get a crane to get that car off. They want to say to the team, they need help pushing, but there's so many safety team members tending to the inverted car of Stingray Rob as they'll take very big care to roll the car back over as gently as possible. Oh, wow. Kyle Kirkwood out with nothing to help. I haven't seen Alexander Rossi yet. That's a relief. That's a relief. But Kirkwood can so to stick to the AML safety team. Doing the usual stellar work. You can see Sting Ray Rossi talking with the AML safety team inside the cockpit. There's Alexander Rossi. And for as calm as things finished with the front, with the top five runners, something went horribly wrong at the back of the field. This is what happens. Oh, shit! Oh, my God. 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 Yeah, something clearly wrong with the seven of Alex Rossi and slow on the two. And these are just these cars are just that were cars reacting are because Rossi would have been Rossi spinning been across spinning the track. The track. Yeah, and I'm sure yeah, Kyle Kirkwood and Ed Carpenter, here's Kirkwood another angle. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Ed is losing oh, it on his own. Same, same with Kyle Kirkwood, Kyrkwood, just, getting, just on getting on the brakes. When you see an IndyCar in, in the air or up like, like that, you tend to react in ways that might not be normal. Yeah, right, right here, right here. What the? Yeah, right. Stay right. Yeah, I'm fine. What if? What if? Copy. Copy. Front really slow. You're like a one. All good. All good. I'm just stuck. Get this car off me. All right, copy that. Copy that. Just sit tight, okay? Um, yeah, just hang on in there. I'll come get you. And they're gonna have to come get you out of the car. So that's a twenty. That's not copy there. I I don't know if you'll be able to get out. I know I Rossi know was Rossi running out of fuel and uh, stayed online. He was going much, much slower. Much slower. Uh, my, spotter my spotter surprised me of the situation, me of the situation but um, clearly it's a bit clearly too late for Stingray, for Stingray there. there. Um, so, uh, hopefully so hopefully he's okay. Hopefully, okay. hopefully, uh, hopefully uh, everyone that's gone out is, is okay. It's yeah, definitely yeah, a very, very scary wreck. As soon as I saw that, I still have a Stingray actually slow. Right in the air, and it's pretty much like a parachute when you're sitting perpendicular to the road um, with one of these cars. That I lifted out of the throttle out of the corner and then instantly spun myself. Um, yeah, so that's unfortunate. Sorry for the guys. We're having a good race there. Um, but, you know, uh, we were actually still on the, the last lap, so we actually didn't finish that bad.
I'm actually surprised about this team that we finished 16. So, um, yeah. Uh, sorry to the guys. Hopefully everyone's okay. Scary wreck. Glad everyone is semi okay. A lot of us are claustrophobic too. When you're trapped in the car, and I'm sure it's boiling hot. What were those few moments like, and how anxious was that? Uh, I hate being stuck inside the car. I, there's there's no doubt about that. When I was stuck in, in, in at Indianapolis upside down, the first thing that you want to get, get out of the car, out of the car. Um, um, and, and obviously, obviously the, the, the safety crew came over there got to me within seconds, seconds and they calmed me and down and said you're good we'll help you out we're here for you, we're here for you. Um, um, so that was that was very that calming, was very for, calming me. for me um, but no uh, but initial uh, thought when you crash and there's a car on top of you or you're stuck the last thing you want to do is be on fire and initial instinct for drivers is to get out but obviously these cars are so safe now to where we don't have to be too concerned and obviously the AMR safety crew was there for us in case anything Glad you're okay. Thank you, Kyle. Thank you. Damn. What can you do?